we're going to set the JTA log to uh, to be uneditable so you can't edit whatever is inside it so set editable to false <clears throat> we're also going to instantiate our scroll pane set it to new j scroll pane and what the scroll pane is going to take is whatever you're going to put inside the scroll pane and remember I told you guys we're going to put our JTAX area inside our scroll pane so we're going to put in the JTA log inside our scroll pane and what we want to do is show so we're putting our JTAX area this thing inside our scroll pane and we're gonna set our scroll bars to visible the way we're gonna do that is this scroll pane dot set horizontal scroll bar policy and as we're gonna pass in j scroll pane dot horizontal always for always showing the horizontal scroll bar and do that for the uh, vertical scroll bar too scroll pane dot set vertical horizontal I mean vertical scroll bar policy it's gonna take in the uh, J scroll pane dot vertical scroll bar always and again these are just integers these are just IDs static final integers if you actually look at the documentation they're just static final integers they're basically uh, used as flags so what we're doing is we're flagging it we're telling we're flagging the uh, the horizontal scroll bar to show always we're telling the the scroll pane to always show the scroll bar we're gonna do the same for the vertical vertical scroll bar always and now we've instantiated all of our widgets now let's actually add those widgets to our screen to our uh, our panel add widgets so let's go on over to our our to our uh, add widgets method, which is over here in the bottom. And what we're going to do is we're just going to add everything in order. First, we're going to add our widgets to our horizontal boxes. So each box, we're going to add uh, our label. Okay, so this is basically how it's going to go. Our first horizontal box, horizontal box one, is going to contain, horizontal box one is going to be this, right here. It's going to contain our J label for the ISBN and the, the, J, uh, the J text field for our ISBN. So it's going to contain this J label and this J text field. Again, H box number one horizontal box number one is going to take in a J label and a text field and we're going to do the same thing up to new file so horizontal box one dot add and we have to add this in order from left to right we're going to add in our uh, our J label ISBN then add in our uh, our J text field so J T I S B N and we're gonna do this up to uh, our file so we're gonna do this up to horizontal box H box 5 so just copy 
paste for number two, three, four, five, and change the numbers two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five. Instead of these, instead of JL ISBN, it's going to be JL title. JT title and we're just going to do the same thing for the rest Now we're going to add, so these lines of code correspond to adding, adding these, the J, all the J labels inside. So this is, I'm sorry, this is HBox 1, this is inside HBox 2, this is inside HBox 3, 4, and 5. Now let's add uh, our browse button and add file to book button inside our HBox number 6. Then H box number seven is going to contain this J label and then this J button. H box number seven is going to contain this J text area, and H box number eight is going to contain these two buttons. I'm going to stop talking for now because I'm running out of my voice is dying on me. Add a button browse. Our button add. Damn it. Add button. Button add book. No, add file. H box seven. We're going to add our uh, JL log. Also, going to add inside our HBox7 our uh, button add book. So, it's supposed to be log dog. In wait a minute, I think I made a mistake somewhere. File is at five, browse is at six. One second, guys. Oh, okay, I see what's going on. All right. We're actually not going to add this J text area inside a horizontal inside a horizontal box because the only thing that's going to be the only thing that's going to be on this section is just this. So we don't need to add a uh, horizontal box. So we're just going to add it in there in our uh, main box later on. But uh, anyway, we're going to add our last two buttons in our last horizontal box. Let's add in uh, button save. And button save and quit. Now that we've added, now that we've added everything that we needed to add inside there, corresponding uh, horizontal boxes. We're going to add our horizontal boxes in our main box. Let's 